Hey there, it's Holly, your shopping buzzkill. Believe it or not, the buzz you get from buying stuff is not actually about the product. What? It's about the thrill of the chase. We know this by measuring dopamine release in your brain. I love shopping so much! Neuroscience has proven dopamine spikes in anticipation of a reward, not when you get the reward itself. So when you're online shopping, dopamine is released when searching for product. Online sales, useless stuff! You think you want this? And I've got something remotely similar or something that you might be interested in right now! And then while you're waiting for it in the mail. I can't wait to get this! And the dopamine actually drops when you get it. Woohoo! Oh yeah, that was great. Anyway, how does this warm our climate? We know our stuff costs resource extraction, carbon emissions, mileage in transport, waste, toxic leaching, landfill, etc, etc. Our problem is that we buy so much stuff to enjoy the anticipation dopamine release and then we chuck it away because we didn't really need it or we didn't use it or maybe we didn't like it that much after all. In fact, how much of the stuff we buy do you think we keep longer than six months? 90%? 60%? 30%? Wrong. It's 1%. Yes, 99% of the stuff that we buy is thrown away within six months. That's a whole lot of resources, exploitation and damage to our planet for absolutely nothing. We've all experienced this, especially with targeted advertising and all that. When you buy stuff and a week later you think you don't want it anymore or you have something just like it. So what do we do about it? Simply understanding how your brain works can make a huge difference to your consumer eco footprint because you end up buying less pointless stuff. So enjoy the buzz, but take a step back, be a smart shopper and chill before checkout.